interprets the case of Abraham and Isaac, is it morally right to kill someone who is innocent if God demands it? I think in that case, God wasn't directly asking Abraham to kill Isaac. It was more of, okay, how will Abraham respond to this petition that I ask of him? Because I think in the end, it would be a matter of obedience to God. It's like in ethics or when you study moral acts, isn't it that we apply the principle of double effect? That in fact, we are carrying out something, but we're after a, something that is good in itself. So in this case, Abraham wasn't really after killing Isaac. So he was after obeying God. And now, the apparently killing of Isaac would only mean a secondary consequence of that obeying God. So directly, I wouldn't say it's really morally wrong because I don't think God told him, you should be killing your son, you know? So.